Hey, here we are again in the outdoor Doug and Nikki testing studio because we have such a cool outdoor product to play with. I am excited about this. This is an FPV first party view RC super truck. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take it out, I'm gonna play, share that video with you because that's what you wanna see, right? You wanna see how it goes. Then I'm gonna come back, give you a quick review, Doug score from one to five, let you know what I think of this. And then if you're interested and you wanna know more about it, I'm gonna do the full unboxing, show you what it comes with, explain some of its features, and then you can make your own decision. Hey, let's go play. of two minds with this. You saw the video, lots of stunts, lots of fun. It is nice and quick, but it is definitely a little less sophisticated than some other RC cars I've driven. The controls were a little lax, that kind of stuff, kind of like very edgy, right? Very edgy, like it's hard to smoothly control it, but look, it's got the FPV, which I will tell you, I rolled it like a hundred times. Everything stood, it's nice and solid, working well, still works perfectly. I have definitely torture tested this. This will definitely survive even the roughest of child. So I think I'm gonna have to give this a four out of five on the Doug score for being kind of close to perfect, but still a little underwhelming on the suspension side. But tons of fun to use, enjoy it. If you're still here, let's go do that unboxing. Welcome to the past where I hope I had fun. I don't know, it is the past. But so we're gonna unbox this now, talk about some of the features and what makes this cool or maybe what doesn't make it cool. Maybe I hated it, I don't know yet. I didn't get to play with it. So let's open it, I'm opening it here for the first time. Let's see what it comes with. So I know a couple things that we all wanna know, right? It has, it's a 1080p camera, which is a high definition camera on it for your videos and your first party view, which I just think is so cool. I was actually reading some of the stats on it, right? And I was like, it, because it is a 2.4 gigahertz radio, it can go like 300 feet away from you. And I'm thinking to myself, you can't even see it. How are you gonna drive it? And then I was like, oh wait, it's first party view. Of course you can see it and you can drive it. I just, it is so neat. Never even thought of that before as a thing. You can't even see it and you can drive it. All right, let's see what it looks like. Ooh, this thing is cool looking. Comes with, let's talk with like just the instant things that pop out. So I see it comes with a cool rear wing. Ooh, it's a dual element rear wing. That's pretty cool. Little tool for opening up the remote and repairing things. It comes with one USB charger. Come on, DERC, give us two. We have two batteries, which by the way are 1,000 milliamp hour each, which means you could play for about 30 minutes each or an hour on those two batteries, but I should be able to charge them both at the same time, please, in the future. Comes with an owner's manual instruction book. I highly recommend you read these. All of these things are just subtly a little different, enough to annoy you, so if you just read these first and refresh it in your head, it makes your first experience playing with them so much more just plain old fun, because you're ready to go. All right, so let's take a look at the controller real quick. Okay, it's like a kind of conventional controller with your throttle, brake, steering. Okay, so like I said, thought, it takes four AA batteries. And here is the, oh, this thing is solid. Check that thing out, how cool is that? That thing is really, it is cool looking, solid, really neat. It has, uh, battery pack goes here on the bottom. It has trim control so you can adjust the steering if it gets a little off. And it also has LED lights, including blue LED lights on the bottom, which are just supposed to look wicked at night. Let's just check, we got a couple boxes. I'm assuming they got batteries in them. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got one battery. Oh, the FPV mount for the remote control. It just slides on there to work. 
<laughs> I think it actually looks really cool. Oh. <laughs> okay, obviously it worked because I'm still recording. In any case, the, the truck has left the building, but that was my last thing. And I hope this was helpful. I hope that was a little silly that I just dropped that. And uh, we will see you next time.